Relief all round as that one dribbles over. Two set points saved. But watch Henman staying back for an instant, fooling Courier, then sneaking in. Caught Courier off guard, thinking that Henman was going to stay back for a ground stroke rally. Now, break point. Firmly punched. Short into the open court by Jim Courier. Very confident volleyer now. third break point since the resumption this afternoon. Chances slipping away. Grass court tennis in particular is all about seizing the fleeting opportunities that come your way. That serve jamming Henman in the body, not giving him a chance to get a full swing at it. Three-hour mark of actual playing time. Advantage Henman. Henman here, not sure whether he was going to come in behind that. Five games on. Patiently playing the ball Four back six. low to Courier's backhand and then going for it. The mark of a true champion, able to muster the will to go for shots in big situations.
15 love. Thirty fifteen. Forty thirty. Hedman uh, choosing to stay back behind the first serve and really being caught in no man's land betwixt and between. That was a brilliant slice backhand from Jim Courier. He knifed his racket through the ball and it slid through the court and never bounced higher than six or eight inches off the ground. charging this so as not to let it get down below the height of the net that replay from the reverse angle from the royal box end Leads by six games to five, four sets. He's a stubborn young man, Tim Hemman. You have to be to be a great champion. And he's been playing for the back, got himself into trouble. And when he reverts to plan one, serve and volley, he just immediately Peter looks like a different player. Yes, he is or can be quite a devastating player when he decides to serve and volley, especially when he's in the sort of form at the net that he has been throughout this match. He has been digging out balls off his ankle tops time and time again. You can see here how Heman launches himself into his serve. 
and charges. Sorry. Of course, the closer you can get to the net on your first volley, the easier they will be. Korea served for the set. Now he serves to save it. Attempting the chip and charge, but the serve really got up on him. And he ended up playing the little chip around his left ear. Absolutely perfect. Well, Hemmen coming in, putting the pressure on. But that first volley, just not quite deep enough to trouble Courier. And that was a wonderful topspin lob. And he liked it. This will be the fifth tie break. These two men have played against each other. Each has won two. Eleventh ace. 